Hi, I'm Tom Coffing. Welcome to the brilliance of Natiza. This company, IBM, and their Natiza product changed my life. You know, I've written over 50 books on Teradata, and people often call me Terra Tom. And when I saw Natiza, I had dinner with the president and the mastermind behind this. Jit Saxena was the CEO and president at the time. And of course, Foster Hinshaw was the mastermind behind the design. I found him fascinating and brilliant. And when he explained the architecture of Natiza to me, I said, Foster, you've really got something special here. And Natiza has changed the computing world like nothing I'd ever seen. You're going to have an opportunity of a lifetime to learn this technology, and I'm going to explain it differently than you've ever seen it explained before, and this is going to make you a world-class expert. Welcome. I'm glad you're here with me today. Natisa was built around the most fascinating concept the computer industry's ever seen, parallel processing. And we're going to learn about what that is right now. It's sometimes difficult to kind of picture what that is. Not anymore. Two guys were out on a Saturday night. They were dancing. They were singing. They were rocking and rolling. They were the life of the party. They were having the time of their life. And one of them said, listen, I've got to leave. And he goes, it's midnight. It's just getting rolling. you got to leave. Where are you going? He goes, I've got to go do my laundry. Your laundry on Saturday. Yeah, listen, if I go to the laundry mat, Tomorrow on Sunday, it's going to be filled up. I'll be lucky to get one machine. If I go to the laundromat on a Saturday night at midnight, it's going to be empty. I can get all the machines and do my wash in an hour and my dry, and I'm out of there very quickly. That's parallel processing with a little dry humor. Natiza just got it right off the bat. It's all about the block movement. And I'm going to explain things differently, and I want you to trust me, and I want you to see exactly what the real issues are. Woman came in and said, how are the orders today? And the disc responded, how would I know I'm just a disc? You see, nothing happens on a disc but cold storage. You know, for 20 years, I thought, well, things happen on the disk. They're inserting, they're updating, they're deleting, things are moving, they're cleaning that. Nothing's happening on the disk. Every time they want to read it, update a row, insert a row, delete a row, they bring that block of data off of the disk into memory where it's processed as fast as lightning. And that is the Achilles heel of every computing system moving that data block. And Natiza has figured out some ingenious ways to beat everybody to the punch. And we're going to learn about that concept coming up. The very first term I want you to know is the word S-blade or SPU. They mean the same thing. A SPU is a snippet processing unit it's interchangeable with the term S-blade. And as you can see here, we have four S-blades or four spoos, and each one of these spoos have their own memory, have their own disk. In some ways, it's almost like they're their own computer. Then Matiza brilliantly takes a table, breaks up the rows. Some go to this spoo, some to this spoo, some to this spoo, some to this spoo, and now they can process those simultaneously, and it's four times as fast. But what if we had 100 spoos? It's 100 times faster than a traditional computer. What if we had 1,000 spoos? It's 1,000 times faster. Double the spoos, double the speed. Here you can see a picture of a user who might query a Natiza system. They write their SQL or their map reduce function, and it's entered to the host. The host is going to take that SQL. It's going to check the syntax, the security to make sure you have access to that table, and then it's going to come up with a plan. It'll pass that compiled plan to each one of these spoos who will go out and follow those instructions to AT. And that's the general architecture that I want you to see when you think about Natiza. This lesson is brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Serving the data warehousing needs of the world for 20 years. Check out coughingdw.com for more information.